uh, from London. Tamna, thanks all for joining us this afternoon. First of all, congratulations, congratulations. I do not understand the lecture, but you should give us insight on that. I love good stories. Tell us about it. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you so much for having me on ENCA. Um, it's research about acid mine drainage treatment, so kind of pertinent issue in Africa. We're trying to treat it using waste material, so creating kind of a circular green economy. And exactly what does it mean for you, I mean, to be able to not only represent your, your country, I am looking at it from a continental perspective, to be really a spearheader um, when it comes to the continent and the way in which it contributes to, to science. Uh, it was, I feel very lucky and it was an extreme honor to be able to represent Africa, especially this university in a competition at this level. Um, and I feel very lucky to be able to to be involved in research that is so relevant at an international scale. Um, communication and science is very important to me and to other people in the world. So I think it was a very um, a, a very uh, beneficial competition for myself to be involved in and be able to spread, disseminate information regarding this topic. And also looking at the fact that, I mean, right now we're in a position where we're trying to encourage many young women to start being interested in the STEM-related fields. How then do you start encouraging them, especially from those that are in school who may even be feeling intimidated by STEM subjects? I think the world is really changing at this point in time. I think women who are going into STEM positions at this point in time are unlucky in that it's much easier. And I would say... I would definitely encourage women um, to go into these kind of fields. We have a very unique view on um, issues and problems that the earth faces, and it's always good to have that perspective. So I would definitely encourage women to go into these kind of fields. It's much easier than it used to be, and every woman that enters the field makes it just much easier for other women to enter. I'm going to leave it there because I can hear the traffic in the background and I can also see that uh, we're going to struggle a little bit with signal there. But it does not go uh, without recognizing the fact that you've done absolutely superbly. Women that are representing the country on a global, global platform, what more could be better on a Tuesday afternoon?